All right, I have one box of floor pops that I've laid out. This will be easy for me because my existing lino is also the same size as the new one, so it's going to be easy to find the middle of the room and start on my project. I just took out one package just to get an idea of how it's going to look, and it's great. It matches really well with my Benjamin Moore paint color on the walls. I'm happy with that. Just something I would keep in mind when you're going through your boxes is some might have a little bit of, not damage, but a little bit of scuff on them. So this one here has a little bit of a scuff here. Not a big deal, but I'll put it over in this corner where it won't be seen by my bookshelf. And this one, I noticed had a little bit of the adhesive already unstuck um, when I took it out of the package. I don't think that's a big deal because again, I can find a place to put it like a corner that will be covered under a shelf, or I can choose to have this to be a piece that I cut and waste when I go around the toilet, around there, I'm gonna to have to do an L cut, and then under the heat register, which I might actually just unscrew it and lift it up. If I can't wiggle it underneath, we'll take a look and see. So anyways, it looks beautiful. I'm really impressed with these floor pops. My first time ever using them, and I think it's going to be quite easy to do and easy to line up. And the pattern I've picked, I think, is really pretty. Super cool. Remember, wash your hands.